Tech Innovation Forum is designed to be a brand new, original, engaging platform to share knowledge from water utilities and the supply chain. We're looking at targeting water utility chief technology officers and around that level chief digital officers, chief innovation officers, as well as the supply chain. And we really want to deliver something different. You know, there's a, the water market is completely saturated with events. And so this gives us an opportunity to create something brand new, something engaging and a chance for people to walk away with you know, great content, great ideas and, and great contacts. And part of the reason of being here in Amsterdam is it was the very first advisory board meeting. So during the planning stages, we put together a list of over 10 water professionals from around Europe and surrounding areas, comprising water utilities, engineering consultants, technology providers, researchers. And the idea is we're really building this panel of experts that's eventually we're going to be creating an event for the industry by the industry. So two major themes came out from the meeting. The first was the digitalization of the water market. So how brand new pieces of software, AI systems, uh, are really impacting and disrupting the traditional ways of delivering water. Well, for Fitens it's, uh, it's key. So we, want to, we have the ambition to be a 24-7 uh, digital utility, a smart utility where digitalization affects every, every single part of our business. And um, uh, what we've seen, we've done a lot of testing since 2012 with all kinds of sensors, with data, with, with just technology. And what we now see is that we really get the value out of it and we're even able to make business cases that explain what, what we're doing and also help to assess on the, on the strategic level whether or not we want to invest in it. And what you see is that there's a strong commitment even from senior management to really invest in, in the digitalization. Um, and what I think is important is that we want to be 100% in control. So we want to have control the water flow from source to tap, but we also want to control the assets that we use and optimize them for cost and also for, for durability. And you really need data to do that. And it really brings us to a next level where we can enrich just the, the, the experience of, of our engineers with, with data and it really helps them to do a better job. So I think uh, the era for the analogue side of things is coming to a close. We've moved away from writing things down on paper on sites, uh, storing things and not being able to reference it. And now we're seeing this real move to be able to surface all that information and do something uh, clever with it. So the, the impact on the water sector is to drive efficiency, is to improve operating conditions, and generally I think to make work life and balance in the workforce uh, a lot uh, more, a lot easier than, yeah. uh, than it was before. Digitalization is inevitable, even in the water sector. And um, the water sector is, um, has a history of data management that is usually paper-based. And uh, with every uh, generational change in personnel management, there is a loss of knowledge and expertise in the business. So uh, digitalization will first of all help in terms of uh, changing the way uh, data is being handled and how a water utility becomes a custodian of uh, data, information and knowledge. Following the Aquatech Innovation Forum is the start of the Aquatech Amsterdam exhibition, which everyone knows and loves. And the idea is that the bridge is, is kind of connecting the two, whereas you have more project level discussions in the forum, the visitors and delegates can then see the technology firsthand on the exhibition floor for the, the days afterwards.